Hey guys, if you've been following my channel for a while, you've probably seen this. Maybe you sub for this product back in the day. This is the box from the Flag Color Raptor 390 Tower. And I will say, this is awesome, all in one. It's still my primary go to board, you know, board and ESC together. And uh, recently, they came out with the new model, the Raptor S Tower. So I contacted your best and asked them if they could send me one for a review. And here it is. Fly color S tower. Now, this is pretty much good. just going to tell you guys the differences between the tower. Um, I was planning to have a build done for the tower, but let me, let me show you how that turned out. I ordered these red bottoms, and as you can see, these wires aren't going to work. Now, I could add bullet connectors like I did on my other build but i didn't want to do that so i'm waiting on some different motors coming with some longer wires so for now just gonna have a little overview of the tower itself which is not in the box um it comes of course in the same packaging same set of wires come with it now the new board has a new design which i actually like some people aren't really liking the new layout of things but i actually really like it the top board is a little smaller they cut that away so that's going to save some weight and they move the ESC pads as you can see to the sides in sort of x um, configuration and they move the power leads to its own little tab back here in the back and now if you guys can remember i'll ship it up on the screen right now a picture of the original one how tight that was to solder for me, it was ridiculous. I think with this, it's a lot more space in between the pads. It'll be a lot easier to get everything soldered up. Now, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys this. The rest, rest of this might be on the computer. Just going to be a little overview of some differences. Now, before I get started, I got to say a couple things. First off, GearBest is having their third anniversary sale. So, you guys might want to check that out. Now, here is... The new tower and the old tower, right? $3 difference. Now, right off the bat, $3 difference for the upgrades. Just get the $3 more one. But check this out. I didn't even know this until I went and looked. The S tower and the original tower are both on flash sale right now. So $70 bucks for the original and $63.59 for the upgraded model, which is just crazy. So there's 12 pieces left at the time of this filming. If you're interested in this, this is definitely a good buy. I mean, this is an all-in-one stack for less than the price that you pay for just ESC sometimes. And this is and it's 30 amp D shot capable ESCs. Like you guys, you really can't beat this deal right now. So I'm pretty sure these 12 pieces will be gone by today. But if you guys are quick, go ahead and jump on that. Get it while you can. Um, now back to differences uh let me see where am i not that don't worry about that all right here goes the original this is the original board as you can see right here the pads were darn near touching this was really hard for me to solder up especially since i used a gauge of wire that was too big um no fault of anyone else's but that's what, how how it went down um now some people like this because the pads are on front and back now, if you have those really, really, really tight builds where you can't have wires coming out the side, maybe this isn't the board for you, or maybe you'll just have to wire it up where, you know, you wire it going inside, you pretty much cross the wires over the board instead of coming, well, no, you can't do that because it's stacked. So, yeah, if you're really tight where you can't have wire, motor wires coming out the side, this isn't the board for you, or get the original version, which doesn't look like this anymore. It actually changed. This is the version I got. And then it changed to this, which actually gives you a little more space in between the, the solder pads. So if you order the original version, this is the version you will get. Um, if you need them come out front and back, just get this version. It's still good. It still runs um, BL Heli. still runs multi-shot. Uh, and, you know, it's still a very, very capable machine. Like I said, that's my main flyer at the moment. Now, these are the cords you get with it. Very basic. And... Now, here we have the upgraded version. As you can see, I don't need to show you on the computer anymore. But I personally like the new layout a lot. I like that these pads are separate. These are really easy to solder up. 
Uh, of course, I'm waiting on motors, so I can't really show you that much there. But the big thing about these are these are BLE S ESC. So what does that mean? That means that you don't need to tell it what protocol you're running, whether it's one shot, one shot for 42, multi shot, or D shot. Well, D shot you'll have to flash, but right right off the jump, you can just plug this in, go into beta flight, type multi shot, and it'll start working with multi shot. That is the advantage of BL Heli S ESCs, which this now has. Just awesome, guys. Sorry, I got a little interrupted there. But anyways, guys, um, you know, if you guys want to check this out, I'm going to have links below to this one and the original one. Um, you can check out the specs, the weight, and all that. Of course, I'm going to have more videos coming soon. I'm not sure if I'm going to really do a build video because, you know, there's not much to build other than <laughs> soldering the wires on here. And that's why I love these all in ones. Um, but yeah, I really wanted to just rush this video out since I noticed that it's on flash sale and I wanted my subscribers to be able to take advantage of that if you guys are interested in this, if you guys are interested in this product. So anyways, guys, uh, not much. Got more coming soon as soon as my motors come in. Hope you guys enjoy. Thanks for watching. If you guys uh, want to see more, you're, you know, of course, more content is coming on this. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And that's about it. Thanks for watching. See you next time.